Hello and welcome. So I'm back today with a new video. Hello and welcome back. 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 So hello and welcome back. 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 So today, a very, very special video. Um, enough of the Fez. Fez to return later in the video. Um, we hit 50,000 subscribers very, very recently and it's been amazing. I just can't believe it. I am overawed and uh, so very thankful and grateful for all your kind words, your kind support over all this time that I've been making these videos and to, to hit 50,000 subscribers is absolutely phenomenal. So to celebrate, I have got an absolute killer giveaway. I've been teasing and mentioning that I've got some good prizes to give away to you guys, subscribers in the comments. Um, and boy oh boy, have we got some awesome stuff to come. But um, firstly, just again, a massive thank you from me. Uh, the YouTube channel has been such a shining, beacon of light in my life and I know if I'm having a rubbish day I've got you lovely people leaving me nice comments um, letting me know what you've been finding and giving me kind words of encouragement and support over all the different channels the discord the Instagram Facebook TikTok Twitter all the diddly dees and doodly doos that I have um, it's it's I'm very very grateful uh, we're, we're gonna get to the giveaway at the end of the video but I thought let's first have a look back at some interesting moments there's some old clips there's some new clips and the old clips are very hard looking at because I can't stand them but firstly um, a massive thank you as I keep saying to you subscribers you viewers lovely lovely people keeping the channel going but also a thank you to all the kind coin tubers my friends and fellow coin tubers who have helped and make made videos with me for my channel I'm Al from Absolute Coins. And I'm Dan Temple. And I'm joined by my good friend, Caledonia Coins. Hello, and thank you for having me. I'm uh, Coins to Collect. What's up, guys? It's Laughter. Um, right, I'm UK Coin Hunt. And I'm joined today by Mr. James B. Hoy Coins. A very good morning to you. And I'm joined by Coin Cupboard. Hello. It's uh, Bungle Collects. Lady M and I are taking part in Christopher's Coin tuber challenge? Do we do we actually even know what it's no, called, ADM? We don't know. I haven't got a clue. I'm joined by two other coin tubers today. They're going to be doing the hunt for me. On my left, I have Gracie Coin Hunts. Hello, hello, everyone. And to my right, I have Cage Jones Coins. Hi. Over all this time, we've had some really awesome finds as well, and I thought let's have a delve back <laughs> and have a look at the, some of the highlights. I'm so glad that yesterday's video went out before this video because I'd have been gutted to not have been able to include that clip as well. So let's have a look at some coins. Any of those to be added to the collection? <gasps> no. What a pool. Olympic Games football. Wow. And there is our first Commonwealth Games. So let's zoom in and have a look. It's not the clearest view, but that is Northern Ireland, which is the uh, lowest, uh, lowest mintage figures of denomination in two pound coins in circulation at the moment. So I was absolutely chuffed with this one. I just couldn't believe it. I was trying to, you can see, trying to figure it out. Trying to get a better look on it. Because it's really difficult to tell whether it's Commonwealth Games or whether it's Northern Ireland or not. But you can see that flag, there's that little separation at the top of the cross. <gasps> no! Oh my god! We actually found... Please don't be a fake. Oh my god, please don't be a fake. I don't think it is. Holy moly. <laughs> I actually found a Q Gardens on video. What is going on? God, my hands are shaking. Wow. Well that has made my day. Holy moly. God, I, keep, I just keep thinking I'm going to wake up in a minute. Look at that. What a beauty. Wow. Right. God. Jeez. What a good start with Olympics. And then to find the Kew Gardens. Oh. What's that? It's Commonwealth Games. What is that, Wales? I think it is. Oh, I need to get my eyes tested. Jeez. Definitely Wales, isn't it? What a pool, though. Eh? 
Now, Commonwealth Games Scotland, but to find two in a bag. Cool. I've got a lot of words on that one. <gasps> we got a 2011 shield. 9, 10, 11, and 16. Holy Toledo. I've only ever found one other NIFC year. What a find. So we need something big to make this video worth it. Oh. Oh. Can you believe that's the last one in the bag? Car, I'm kind of lost for words now. Well, that kind of, um, crumbs if I can get my words together, that finishes my £2 coin set. <gasps> we got one! No way. Oh my good golly. You don't know how happy that makes me. Oh my goodness, we got one! We got one! Woohoo! Ah, oh, man, I am so happy. Oh, no, we got it! Olympic wrestling! God, back to back finds. Smashing. Absolutely smashing. Ooh! It's Commonwealth Games. Oh, please, please, please. Please, please, please. It is! No way, Jose. Check out the luck on me today. That's just the technologies. Chuck that in the bin. We've got it! We've got it! That is definitely Northern Ireland. Woohoo! Wowee. Wowee. That is my second book complete then. Ooh, and a jersey. Oh, we seem to be picking up some nice um, coins towards the end of this video. 2003. Lovely stuff. Ah! Gosh, just saying, Commonwealth Games, you haven't found one of. It is Scotland, so it's not one we need, but... Well, try to find one of these. Don't find them too often. Go out, ask, and you shall receive. <gasps> Get out! No way! Holy Toledo! Did you just see what I saw? What on earth? What is going on? That is what four wrestlings I found in this book. Whoa! Holy Toledo! What on earth is going on? Quite fun, they're squeezing down. <gasps> No! We've done it! Holy Toledo! That's the last one we needed! Oh, Battle of Britain. <laughs> I've always wanted to say this. Well, properly. Uh, let's zoom in then. Have your moment. Oh, are you going to do, gonna, gonna <laughs> Go do the thing? So, with the Battle of Britain, uh, on the 50p's, there is two mint marks. One was released into circulation, one wasn't. Uh, the JC, Jodie Clark, was released and IRB wasn't. So, if you find a... Uh, just not the camera there, my apologies. Uh, if you do find an IRB, then it's not intended for circulation. And it's fairly shiny, but, oh my God. Is that actually? It's IRB. No what? Way! It's IRB. Holy Toledo. <laughs> it's IRB. It actually is. No oh way. Oh my God. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no I can't way. believe it. I don't believe it at all. No way. Let me have oh a look. It's IRB. I'm getting in a shot now. Oh my lord! Turn it back over. I don't believe it. It's got a bit of toning around the edge, so it's. Like... I don't mind that. Goodness <laughs> gracious! No, I mean, no. so yeah, somebody's. The weeks and weeks prior to lockdown, that the two pound. <gasps> Someone heard me complaining. No way is that Northern Ireland. It is. Well, I take those words all back, because this is the rarest two pound coin in circulation. You can tell the difference in the cross because there's a little bump there. 
I think it's the is it the Ulster, uh, the Ulster hand, Ulster fist, Ulster hand of Ulster, so, something like that. What an exceptional coin! Holy Toledo! Victoria Cross, the medals there. <gasps> oh my God! Jeez! No way! Holy Toledo! What is going on? <laughs> Holy Toledo! <laughs> My heartbeat! What on earth is going on? This is Come on, so Lucky! Come on! <laughs> How many episodes did we get stuck on this coin? How many episodes did we get stuck on this coin? And I just, we just, ah. I'm elated. I am elated. We're not going to get stuck on Commonwealth Games or else. But I have just found two in a row. And we've got a 2011. Oh, our first roll of the dice to try and finish this book. Uh, let's cross our fingers, close our eyes, imagine it. It's going to be. It's going to be. Let's have a feel. Hmm. Well, there's a kicky leg bit there. Or well, it could be a leg bit. It could be. Well, it could be archery actually. Mm -hmm. Don't know. Let's have a look. <laughs> we did it. That's the one we need. Holy Toledo! The book's done. Wowie! There was a kicky leg bit. It wasn't the bow and arrow. Unbelievable. We've, we've finished it. Way well, hey. Potentially our first Olympic for the, for the book. Now, the two pound coin hunts, I was stuck on just Commonwealth Games Wales and we found it in the first book, the first episode of the, first, of the new book. If this is a judo, you might see me throw a coin across the room. Oh no! What is going on? <laughs> Ah, oh, dearie, dearie, dear. That's amazing. Well, at least we know we're not going to get stuck on judo in this book. Holy Toledo, what are the odds of that? Good. Ooh, 2018. Come on, the G. Let's see it. Woohoo! We got it! We finished the book! Holy Toledo, can you even believe it? Oh my goodness, so 2018 book complete, so just 2019 to go. Unbelievable stuff. Wowie. Sort of feel to it. What? No way! I said that as a joke. Oh my goodness. First King Garden of 2021. Oh my god. Woohoo! <laughs> I can't believe it. My heart is pumping. Holy Toledo. What on earth? We've is it, is it real? Is it real? <laughs> Holy word! I can't say on YouTube. I can't believe it. Been interspersed amongst all of the awesome finds, uh, the coins we've hunted through, the, the friends that I've worked with, the uh, videos that I've made. We've had some silly moments too. We've got a sixpence, a new pence, ten pence, a new pence, ten pence, two pence, new pence, five pence, new pence, new pence, new pence, unicorn, new pence. Big silver, 10 pence, new pence, silver proof, 2 pence, 10 pence, no, who knows, new pence, new pence, new pence, not new pence, Benjamin Binny, Benjamin Bunny, Rodney Rabbit, I don't think I've had any Somalian coins, this could be my first, there's Winston Churchill, Millennium Icons, 2000, wow. Today we have a sealed bag of socks to have a hunt through, looking for the commemorative ones, the ones with more than one other to make a pair, it's French, we've had tons of French coins from these bags, French, French. Next, another French, oh my goodness, it's a French invasion today, isn't it? 1979, next, another French, another French, we're back in La France, French, and we're back to France. Can't finish on a French coin, can we? Oh, change the fez. The fez is changing, I'm going to be a bit of like a fez head here. <laughs> and then peace, prosperity and pepperonis maketh the breakfast 50p. Uh, Brexit again. Brexit again. Brexit again. <laughs> We've got another Brexit. Brexit again. 
Never have I ever seen so many commemoratives. I'm not even calling out the Brexits anymore. They're just like shields at the moment. 20. Oh, look at that. Very nice. Mmm. Mm. Dropping them. Dropping them. Ooh. Whoa. Well, good morning. I'm here at the mint now. But no, I'm not. For sake. <laughs> Well, here we go. The moment you guys have all been patiently waiting for. I hope you've enjoyed that little, those little montages. Well, it's not a little, it's a bit of a marathon, but uh, there was so much stuff that I wanted to include and so much more that I couldn't include and fit into the video. But the prizes. So, there's three of these. Two of them are giveaways and one of them I bought for myself. Um, I was very, very excited about these. These are the, these are the big uh, prizes. So, that one's already been open, so I've already had a look at that. But if we get into this one and the other one. Oops. Good start, good start. Okay. And number two. We have got, so these two coins, part of my giveaway. And here it is. It is a two bullion half sovereigns, 2021 dated. I was so chuffed with these when they arrived. And I hope you guys are liking these as, as prizes because I think they are superb. I think they're absolutely lovely. So yeah, two, one, oops, let's get into the second one. Hiding away there. There's the second one. Uh, and then YouTube doesn't give you anything as a well word on 50,000 subscribers. So I, I bought myself a third one as a well done to myself for 50,000 subscribers. So that's gonna go off my shelf. As I said, they're bullion ones. Buying bullion from the Royal Mint is, a, is an experience, I'll tell you that for free. Um, but yes, so, how am I giving these away then? So, two of the sovereigns, or the, the, the half sovereigns, I, I should say, um, are going to be giveaway prizes. This one is mine, for me. <laughs> um, so, in the past, I've done postcard giveaways. So, everyone who sends me a postcard uh, will be entered into the random draw to see who wins one of these half sovereigns those that have sent uh, postcards in the past you're on my shelf you'll automatically be entered if you're not sure if i've got one of your postcards just send another one they're, they're nice prizes i'm sure you'll, you'll you'll like that for those that want to send a postcard in the option to win one of these that is the p.o box address is down in the description as well bah, 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 bah. you have a month from today to get them in uh, so what are we going to be this going to be the 6th so the 6th of june will be the cutoff point i will ensure that i've pre-recorded all of my p.o box um, post so that I can get out all the postcards and get them into the draw by the point that the uh, giveaway um, comes to an end so but the quicker you do it the more the sooner it'll happen but please don't bombard me asking if I had your postcard yet uh, we will I will get through everyone's mail before the close of the draw the other one is gonna go to a random comment left on this video so you have to be liked like, like the video subscribe to the channel and leave me a comment leave me a question pref preferably because I can use them then in my future Q&A's on a Saturday 10p hunt think of some out-of-the-box questions as well I've had an inordinate amount of people ask me what my favorite coin is what I would design as, as a coin if I had if I could what denomination of coin would I create have a moment think about an interesting question you don't think I have had before but as I said they are just the two big prizes I should, maybe should have gone with them second I then have one, two, three, four, five runner-up prizes. We're going to the open one already. And that is five one ounce fine silver bullion Britannias. What a beautiful coin that is. It is absolutely stunning. And just look at the obverse of that. That sort of mesh patterning on the obverse is absolutely beautiful. But yeah, again, at least I think Although they are the littler prizes of the different prizes, they are still very nice prizes. Now again, how are these going to be drawn? Uh, one will go to one of my YouTube members. I will put a roulette wheel together for anyone who's been a YouTube member or at the point of drawing in a month's time is a YouTube member. So one YouTube member will nab themselves a one ounce fine silver William Britannia. The other four are going to go to random comments. So no need to be a member if you're not if you're not already a member. But if you would like to be a member and support my channel that way, 
option. That is an option for you. But there we go. How many can I fit in a hand? Right. I need absolute coins hands for this. Oh, just about. How lovely are they? Absolutely superb, if I say so myself. And I hope you guys are going to enjoy these as prizes. As I said, I built up in my mind that these were going to be awesome giveaway prizes, and I got a bit worried. Maybe it's going to flop, people aren't going to like it. But um, it's free coins at the end of the day, so if you're going to complain, go elsewhere. Go to Bungle's channel. <laughs> I don't mean that. I love Bungle. I love him to bits, really. But yes, some awesome, awesome prizes. Like I said, to be eligible to win, all you have to do is be subscribed to the channel, like the video, leave me a comment. As I said, preferably a question, because that way I can... Um, use them for future Q&A questions because I'm drawing to the conclusion of my latest sort of Q&A uh, uh, segment, segment. A uh, bunch of questions that I've had from previous giveaways. One sovereign will go to a postcard that's been sent to the PO box. If you're going to write a postcard in, do make sure it's obvious who has sent it so that I can contact you. So put your uh, social media link on it or a name or um, um, not, not an address because obviously the address if you put an address on a postcard it'll be returned to you so <laughs> not the best idea um but yes so wrapping up we'll just wrap up one more time to make sure everybody's clear so you've got a month from today uh the 6th of june is the closing point of this giveaway one post one one half sovereign will go to a postcard the other will go to random comments one one ounce silver will go to a YouTube member, someone that's joined the member member section of my YouTube channel, and the other four will go to a random comment left on the YouTube video. But there we go. Some superb prizes, if I say so myself. Um, in the, the proof is in the pudding that I have bought one for my collection to, to serve as a, as a memento of hitting 50,000 subscribers. Um, but no, I'm, 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 I think we've gone through everything. Oh, and uh, people always ask, do you have to live in the UK to win? Nope, I'll ship it anywhere you are, as long as you're on planet Earth, because um, postage to outer space, I would imagine, would be rather expensive. But as long as you're on planet Earth, you're welcome to join. Uh, this is available to new subscribers, old subscribers, those of you that have been here since the dawn of time. <laughs> I'm very, very grateful. Um, and I hope you guys like the giveaway prizes. Well, I think I've passed on long enough. I don't know how long this video has lasted, so thank you for your patience, Santa, but I think it's worth it given the awesome, awesome prizes that we've got available to you. So as ever, all that leads me to do now is thank you all so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for more coins. Bye.